my friends and welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you how to prepare this delicious shrimp pasta. And it's on the spicy side, but it's so delicious. If you're new here, my name is Rosangel. I love all things cooking and decorating. So welcome, come with me and let me show you how to prepare this delicious shrimp spicy, I'm gonna call it spinach pasta. So let's do this guys. Let me show you all my ingredients. And I know I always say this, okay? I know it seems like a lot, and it is a lot. <laughs> but you know, this is gonna be so delicious. You guys will thank me later, okay? So I have about a pound of a shrimp here, and these are uncooked, okay? I'm gonna season these nicely with some of the ingredients I already have here, okay? But let me just break it down. Let me just show you guys what I have. So we got some garlic. I think I have about, yes, five uh, cloves of garlic here. I have some salt. I have some cayenne pepper, okay? I have some pap paprika. <laughs> I have some uh, red uh, flakes here, uh, pepper flakes. I also have some onion powder. I got some garlic powder as well. These are sun-dried tomatoes, okay? I have some oil. I'm actually using some olive oil. I've got a stick of butter, my favorite onions. I have some Parmesan cheese here. We have some black pepper. I have the uh, heavy cream. I don't think I left anything here. I have a lemon. I'm going to use a lemon as well, and I'm going to use... Uh, some of the uh, zest, okay, the lemon zest. So I have some spinach here, okay. Now, with this shrimp pasta, you can choose your favorite pasta, okay. So if you want to do spaghetti, perfect. If you want to do linguine as well, and if you want to do penne or whatever this is actually what i have here in my pantry so this is what i'm going to be using i am not sure which one i'm going to check with my girls and see which they prefer and i think it's going to be spaghetti but i'm not sure so that is optional and now yes to me the pasta makes a big difference i just don't buy any pasta this is like one of my favorite pastas okay so it's up to you guys, okay? Whatever you choose. And I'm gonna be serving this with these uh, garlic rolls. I think it's gonna be perfect and most likely a side salad. So I'm gonna actually start by seasoning my shrimp. And the key here is to make sure these marinate for a few hours, okay? It is a process, but it's gonna be so good. Actually, I don't have my um, white wine out here. I'm gonna be adding some white wine as well. Okay, so come with me guys and let's cook this deliciousness. So let's do this. I'm gonna add a little bit of oil and then I'm gonna add all my ingredients. Okay, so I got here my onion powder. Of course, this doesn't wanna come out. <laughs> Top it. Okay, then we have the uh, garlic, we have the uh, paprika, cayenne pepper, and then I have the salt. Now guys, season to taste. If you think it's gonna need more salt, go right ahead, okay? It's up to you. I like to taste my seasonings so this will do okay so i'm gonna season these nicely if i think it needs a little bit more salt i'm gonna go ahead and add some more salt okay these are gonna go in the refrigerator for about an hour and 45 minutes the key here is to make sure they marinate for a bit if you don't have the time at least give it 45 minutes so I'm ready to do my shrimp. I got my skillet here with a little bit of oil and this is medium high heat. 
that's about a six on my end skillet here is ready we don't want to overcrowd this guy so i'm gonna go ahead and just put a few i'm not gonna put them on top of each other because then they're not gonna cook nicely okay and i'm gonna give it about maybe two to uh three minutes on each side now this is what you want i just flipped my shrimp and this is almost ready mm -mm -mm. Okay, my friends, we're gonna be working in preparing this delicious sauce, but I wanted to show you guys this first. The uh, sun-dried tomatoes that I picked up, they're pretty big. So what I did is I sliced these into nice little pieces. And then my garlic, what I do is, I usually pretty much do this with my garlic all the time. I like using my, uh, my grater and I uh, grate it into nice little pieces, the uh, garlic. So this is key here. We need to make sure we slice these nicely. Our shrimp is ready. Look how beautiful this look. Now let's work on the sauce. I am actually using the same pan. I added a little bit of the oil and my stick of butter. Now that our butter has melted, look how beautiful this looks. We're gonna go ahead and add our ingredients. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with my onions. I'm gonna do the garlic. My sun-dried tomatoes. And I am gonna let this cook for about two to three minutes. This is perfect. All these ingredients have cooked down nicely. I'm gonna go ahead and add half a cup of white wine. And you know what? Here's the key. If you can drink it, you can actually cook with this, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and add half a cup of white wine, whatever you fancy. Oof, flavors, my friends. Gonna go ahead and add the uh, lemon now and the uh, lemon zest, and we're gonna give this another few more minutes. When all these flavors of the wine and the lemon and the lemon zest blend nicely, and we're almost done, my friends, almost done. <laughs> This is ready for the uh, heavy cream. Now be very careful, make sure you put this in a low to medium temperature because this has to cook slowly now. I'm gonna go ahead and add the heavy cream. Just look at the color. Mm -mm. Now this is the time to add your salt. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. And again, my friends, season to taste. I'm gonna add a little bit of black pepper as well. Mix this around for a little bit. And yes, I am going to add a little more heat. <laughs> And if you guys don't like spicy food, you can skip that. Now we're gonna add our Parmesan cheese. And this, we have to be patient. We have to do this slowly until it melts nicely. Now guys, this is ready for the uh, spinach. Now with the spinach guys, I'm gonna do a handful. My girls are not too spinach friendly, I should say. So I'm just gonna do a handful. I don't think they're gonna be able to actually taste the spinach with all the deliciousness in this sauce. 
and this is actually guys the time you want to check to make sure you need some salt I check mine and it is perfect 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 The simmer and you're gonna see how small these leaves are going to get <laughs> so so good this is perfect 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 look how pretty this looks my friends this sauce is ready look how pretty and it tastes divine because yes guys I already tasted mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna go ahead and boil my pasta and guess what my family went for the penny pasta <laughs> let me show you guys how beautiful this came out so we're gonna go ahead and add the pasta now and yes guys my family went with the penny pasta not the spaghetti now we want to make sure we toss all this deliciousness around. Mm -mm -mm. You just have to be patient. It's beautiful. And I'm gonna plate this. It's gonna be so good. And I always say this, guys, especially pastas, it's something you have to eat as soon as it's done. It's not the same if you let it sit for a while, but you do have to let it sit for a few minutes so all these ingredients can actually marinate nicely just look how pretty this looks so so pretty i'm gonna go ahead now guys and i'm gonna add my shrimp and as you can see guys we're not skimpy <laughs> we are not skimpy This is gonna be so good. And yes, I'm gonna add some more cheese. And then we're gonna plate this, and it's ready to go. Oh my goodness, it's so delicious. I'm gonna go ahead and add some cheese. And then I'm gonna add some cheese at the end as well, just to plate it. But for now, we're gonna go ahead and let this sit for a few minutes before serving. My friends, I sure hope you have enjoyed this recipe. It is delicious, guys. And when I tell you, I know there's a lot of ingredients, it's so easy 45 minutes if you prep ahead which is the idea with any dinners so if you want to impress your friends and family this right here will do it so I'm gonna give it a try I'm gonna give it another try for you guys I'm gonna have the pasta and we actually did the penne pasta I thought the girls were gonna go with the spaghetti but penne pasta it was Delicious. I can taste the shrimp, garlic. So creamy, delicious. You know what? I'm gonna add more spice because we like the spicy here. Mmm, so good. Mm -mm -mm. Cheers, my friends. I sure hope you have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the little bell, guys, so you guys don't miss out on videos. Bye bye.